I made some sales ads with three different platforms, Veed.io, Descript, and Canva. Here are my results and comments on each. This was made with Veed.io. It took me about one and a half hours. I made it from a template and changed it up to fit my presentation. Veed.io has many tools to enhance pictures, text, and layouts. The timeline is easy to edit. This mail ad was made in Descript. It took me the longest at about 3 hours just for this bit. I have been using Descript for over 6 months and it's still hard to learn and use. I find myself watching a lot of YouTube videos and searching for help to do something in it. Descript does have the ability to edit your transcribed audio when you edit the transcript. It also reflects in the timeline as well. It has a lot of tools to clean up your scripts and organize your storyline, and it provides an engine that can replace spoken with your own voiceover. Coming up is the mail ad made with Canva. After that, I will break down the pros and cons of each and compare aspects of the three that I deal with each time I work with each application. in Canva fit for Instagram posting. Some of it doesn't fit the V.io template used here. Canva only took me 15 minutes to put it together. I was able to make a YouTube version and then change it to Instagram format in those 15 minutes as well. Canva offers a wide variety of pictures, graphics, frames, prefabricated text formats, and layouts to make several different projects. It is usually my go-to application, and then I tidy up or add specialized options with V.io or Descript. Pros of V.io Easy to use Nicely finished product The free version has a good range of use without a subscription. Uploads in a cloud while working on it. Has AI text-to-speech and works. Has a good source of elements, pre-made texts, and templates. Timeline is very easy to view and edit. Audio library is accepted over all platforms I use, YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok. Downloads are quick and flawless. Remove background and green screen are useful working tools. Cons of V.io Cost and division of things I can do on my subscription. Making my own template bumps me up to business. Sometimes undo feature doesn't go back far enough within the automatic saves in the cloud. Doesn't have a feature to take out unnecessary filler words automatically. Doesn't let you search in every department, just certain areas. V.io gives me a very polished demonstration across several different platforms. I find V.io and Canva's applications easier to work with than Descript. The learning curve with Descript is very heavy. I love the versatility of how Canva can change project sizing with a few clicks. Like changing from YouTube format to Instagram, story to reel, etc. without having to be knowledgeable in all the different sizes. In Canva, there is a drop-down menu to select what format I want to change to. I click it and voila, it is done. Recording my picture and voice in V.io is more stable than Canva and or Descript. Canva and V.io are similar in their canvas and timeline appearance and use. With V.io's AI intelligence engine, I can make subtitles easily. I feel much more confident using V.io and Canva to make good, polished ads and videos. All three are regularly updated, adding new features, and open to consumer feedback. All three also are easily found with tutorials.